Hi guys, I'm here today with my scentful and my last mint mongoose. My name is Fawn and this is my channel and this is my happy place. Please do join me um, if you like unboxings and chatter and hauls. You'll notice a bit of a change. Look at this girls. Look, I've cut it off or had it cut off I should say. That colour wow video. <laughs> What an eye-opening experience to see myself on video. I knew that my hair was bad of a morning. I knew that I was struggling and fighting the good fight. I didn't realize really that the only time it looked tidy was if I was willing to spend 20 or 30 minutes of a morning hot ironing it. Get down, Bert. So I came to a decision that it had to come off. And there we have look right in at the nape of the neck now whether i'm going to be able to keep it like this because i've had it done today whether i'm going to be able to keep it like this is a whole nother thing because as the hairdresser said quite rightly my hair is curly so it is a bit of a challenge to get it as sleek as this but i am hoping and praying and i may have a keratin treatment and things like that just to because yeah yeah that video whoa, i tell you i have learned to look past a lot of my faults and close my eyes to bits of me that I just think oh my god that's awful <laughs> but <laughs> that was just my lowest moment <laughs> anyway these are the last two things that have been held over from when I took my little gap and this is also my last mint mongoose for a while I decided I have a lot of jewelry now um, and more to the point I can get this open more to the point the customs charges and things were, were making it pretty silly so i've decided to take a break for the time being this is not a, i will never do mint mongoose again because i really like mint mongoose it is though a break so we'll start with the t-shirt black can never go wrong with a black t-shirt what does it say fear is taking the back seat that is a really good one for me fear is taking the back seat love that love that. i love a slogan a lot of people hate things with slogans on my daughters loathe things with words on anything printed on their chest me i'm not bothered so let's see what helena at mint mongoose had to say this month's set is inspired by facing your fears what a brilliant one for me whoa put my glasses on though because i can't read the rest um she talks about always being nervous um fear of the dark so okay um the first layer is identifying your fear the second is changing the way you look at the fear okay so here we go let's open it up and have a look at the jewelry and then it might make a bit more sense because i've read that and i'm still like hmm, the first layer is <laughs> so let's just right in we go so yes i saw that video well not saw it i edited it and let me tell you editing takes ages or it does when i'm doing it um so having to look at myself like that over and over again and just thinking can i even put this up really got in there and made me think as usual you get a word that's original in the bottom and your thank you card <laughs> oh hiccups excuse me as you can hear as well i have yet another bug these children it's these children they've all had it and i've been fighting it off for about oh two weeks now but it has finally got me it's not um corona or covid or anything like that it is literally a bit of a cold um i know this because the kids have had to do um tests for school and my daughter and her husband have as well and they haven't got it and i haven't got it but sore throat okay so let's dig in we'll start with the earrings i always like starting with the earrings um I've talked some nonsense on here, don't I? I get distracted. I forget what I was saying. I can't get this open. <laughs> I'm having one of those. Yeah, after seeing myself, I just got on the phone and I was like, I need to find the hairdressers. And the hairdressers I went to before and did the curly hair and everything, I felt pushed by them. Do you know what I mean? I felt like 
I'm not saying it wasn't right, but it wasn't me. This is more me. So um, I just decided not to go back to that one and to try somewhere new, seeing as it had been so long. Um, ooh. So here we go, earrings first. Whoops, a daisy. Oh, they're cute. Look at those. Hang on, I'm gonna get them up in a minute. There's me saying, they're cute. You can't even see them. If I get the one up, here we go. And I'll use the black box. Isn't that pretty? It's on a shepherd's crook. And it's just this little, almost like, um, like a starburst. That's really gonna catch the sun and look really pretty, won't it? Oh, I like that. So there's a pair of those, the earrings first. Shall I put them in? Let's see if I can. There we go. I've put one in that side. You wouldn't believe how much I have to edit these videos, honestly. <laughs> I struggle because I'm a chatterbox. So I get distracted and I start talking about other things and I tell you about things and I have to cut them down because honestly, when I join it all together sometimes, the videos are immense. They're absolutely immense. You'd be there all day thinking, shut up. So um, I have to do a lot of editing. Oops, is it in? Yep, it's in. And um, that's the other one. So there's the earrings. Very pretty, I think. Then the necklaces. I still don't know which of these necklaces is which, which is which layer. But this necklace matches the earrings. So again, it has this really nice sort of starburst. This is going to look nice against black. I'm wearing black today. Um, oops. <laughs> I'm going to lower the camera because you can't see. It's actually fallen down into my clivage. Um, I'd have to do another button up on the black. Look, I'm making a right cack of this, aren't I? <laughs> if I did a couple of buttons up on my blouse, then it would sit. <laughs> and then, oh, this may be a good job. I would imagine if Helena ever saw one of my videos, she'd be like, I love I put into these and that daft woman sits there getting it wrong so the second one maybe this because that doesn't strike me as fear ah oh, this is black this will be fear I'll bet you I bet you a pound to a donut if I can ever get it out why won't it come out there we go oh and I really like it. this is really nice look at this I love these earrings that are a stone surrounded by either silver or gold. But yes, I can see how that would be fear. This is the shorter one. So this will be layer one, uh, where she said, you know, layer one is the fear. Um, and layer two is, what was it? Learning, oh, facing your fear. So let's just put that on as well. Have I caught it? Yes, I caught it. I've got so much better at that one. Let's move. Mm, my phone I never take my phone off so I'm, I'm gonna ignore ignore that there's a phone there in the minute and I'll just come down there's the two obviously I think I need to make this one a bit shorter I think it would look better if they sat more like that but as usual I love them I think they're really really great I think it's great value for money but it's the customs charge the delivery and customs has started to hurt a little bit Christmas is coming. There are some new boxes around that I probably want to have a little go of. Uh, one of the ladies was talking about Rocker Box, which I've never had yet. It's a makeup one, admittedly, but I just have enough uh, jewellery for the time being. So, my last Mint Mongoose for a while. And I like it. Then, we have Scentful. I'm not stopping Scentful. I won't be stopping Scentful. <laughs> Um, it is one of those that I do love and at the moment I smell of hair products so I'm quite happy actually that I'm going to be trying this with you um, usual thing little card it all smells amazing the packaging I don't know whether they spray the packaging or something and your usual little box with the copper or rose gold scentful insignia sometimes you have a little note on it sometimes you don't and I'm going to open it now <laughs> there we go Scentful for her. This is October 2021. And inside I have Narcisco Rodrigue. Never heard. Narcisco Rouge is the name of the perfume. And the other one is Burberry Burberry Touch. So, mm, right, let's try. I have never heard of Narcisco Rodrigue. Let me show you. Hopefully it will focus in. 
you can see the name. It says, Narcisco Rodrigue Rouge is a fiery and sensual eau de parfum. The signature heart of musk is animated by a bouquet of Bulgarian rose and iris that sits at the top, supported by the intensity of amber woods, tonic, vetiver, white cedar and black cedar. This infusion creates a fragrance that takes attraction to another level. I have to unbutton my blouse. I don't normally wear my blouses long, but what I've been doing is this business that my daughter said about, um, you know, wearing long sleeve things, but no jacket, having a scarf, but no jacket. And I've been doing that a lot. And I was walking through the town where I got my hair done. It was quite funny because there were people walking towards me and they had like puffer down filled jackets on. And I'm striding along with my long sleeve blouse on. Plenty warm enough. Anyway, here we go. See what am I like? Oh, it's the nose is very nice. Let's have a go. It's quite strong. I like it. I can get the... Yes, I kind of get the Bulgarian rose. Uh, the vetiver. I'm not sure that this is one for me. Um, let me see again. It's called a floral woody with a top of Bulgarian rose and iris. I, I've had issues with iris before. A heart of, called heart of musk, but it's musk, M-U-S-C. And the base is tonka, vetiver, black cedar and white cedar. It is, it is nice. Um, it's not one that makes me think, oh gosh, but it's very in your face, you know? very strong um i can imagine like a businesswoman wearing it it's got that sort of yeah it's got a strength to it that i'm not sure is me really but it's not bad we'll see what happens with it and then the other one is burberry touch now this time i'll remember and spray it on before i chanter on about it so let's get this on shall we oh oh Gosh, that's fruity. Is it fruity? Is it meant to be fruit? Oh, yes, it is. Fruity floral. Okay, Burberry, Burberry Touch. <laughs> Burberry Touch is a fruity and floral eau de parfum with bright yet soft notes of black currant, cassis and pink peppercorns. Touch is an ideal choice for work and play. A dual launch with Burberry Touch for men, the pair evoke feelings of intimacy and sensuality. Enjoy the luxury of the iconic fashion house with every spritz. I don't like it. Not at all. Not at all. The first thing you smell is the fruit. I mean, by gosh, it gets you around the face. It really, really does. But then there's a smell behind it that on me, it smells a bit like petrol. Or, or kerosene or I can't place what that is but it's not working on me at all what does it say fruity floral orange black currant pink peppercorn totally got that I mean wow is it strong but then it very quickly oh what is that smell the heart is jasmine lily peach and raspberry mm. and the base is cedarwood oak moss and vanilla I really dislike that perfume. I don't know what it smells like. That's the, the gospel truth. You get, I get the fruitiness, I get the fruitiness, but that has already not gone off, but I think you, your brain gets, or your nose gets used to it. What the smell is coming from underneath, I do not like it at all. Yeah, it, it, to me it smells a bit like a, like a kerosene or a, it's got a fuely smell to me. And I can't think why, I can't think why that's what my nose is giving me. It makes this one smell lovely. <laughs> and I wouldn't buy this one either. I was doubtful about this one. You could tell, I was saying, oh, it's strong. It's not really for me. It's a powerful woman. But if somebody said to me I had to wear one or the other, 
it would it would be mr Nar. i'm saying mr it could be a woman narciso Rod rodriguez because this oh i think it's vile and there are going to be people out there who get exactly the same box and they're going to be saying wow that is fabulous is it it's the joy of it isn't it it's the joy of it it does mean that we don't all walk down the street smelling exactly the same wearing exactly the same. you know the fact that we're all different um yeah those two <laughs> um i'm not keen on and that's the first time that i've had a scentful with neither of the perfumes hitting the spot for me normally one of them does and i have had them where both were, were great but that for me was a complete bust and i mean they're well known burberry i mean you know yeah there's just something not right with that one and this one now smells so much nicer <laughs> by comparison oh well right so that was scentful roll on next month hopefully next month it'll be better again um, I'm used to having better ones. So that was me for today. Um, I haven't got much done. I've got to, be, got to be honest with my other health issue and then getting this throat thing. I've not been myself the last day or two. Um, I was really grateful that I filmed the, um, the Colour Wow one and another one on the same or even another one i think i might have done three that and i was really grateful because it meant all right i've had to edit them and things like that but i haven't had to sort of talk to you on camera because i've just not felt myself um but hopefully now this is coming my voice is getting better this morning it was awful um and i had to wear a mask in the hairdressers because i mean it's you know you can say until you're blue in the face look i've done the test there is no problem <laughs> But really, if they're nervous, you've just got to say, fine, and wear the mask. So um, I, I took a mask and I said, I will if you want me to. And she was like, oh, because you throat, could you please? And I said, well, you know, maybe I'll just save her from having a stinking cold. Um, but yes, so I haven't got much done, but I'm beginning to feel a little bit more myself. Um, still waiting on the, see, I'm going to fiddle with this all the time. You, I, you're going to be really, you're going to be like, Vaughn, leave your hair alone. Um, still waiting on uh, hearing about when I'm going to see a consultant. But, you know, the NHS as it is at the moment, I'm not surprised that they're going to keep me waiting for a while. I completely understand they're well behind on things for people that are really, really important. So, um, yeah, I'm getting used to the whole little, little adjustment of my system and, and I shall be fine. So that was me. Apple's at the door waiting to come in. <laughs> I'm going to go and let her in now and I'll get to editing this and I'll see you soon. Bye guys.